All right, you need to line with the blog. Stop talking blogs here. Time to look at what we're going to be looking at here is the uh, storm. You can see some different weather advisories. One weather advisory to Baltimore. The more special subject to Washington. We have flood watches. Some close to flood warnings in effect for all of southern New Jersey. We have winter storm warnings. Fox Montgomery, uh, Chester, Lancaster, and the Hope News for heavy snow. And we will see that happen here in the Delaware Valley over the next 24 hours. For sure, our current time frame, you can see the low pressure is down here in South Carolina. But another cost of news, you've been having some sleep here in the Roanoke Valley. This is the cold air up against the mountains. You're going to see uh, be an issue here uh, as it moves north. This is the low bomb valley. Bombogenesis occurred. There's two separate lows still. You get still snow, sleep, green, green. Uh, heavy, heavier snow behind that. And we go down here where Bombogenesis starts off the double, double barrel low off the coast of New Jersey here Saturday. And you see the cold air will entrench itself back into the Delaware Valley as the bomb goes go off here off of the New England coastline. Here's your true Bombogenesis in the new way and the high pressure built in and moves away. So here's our situation and we'll take a look at snow troubles now that I have projected. And I've been talking to Wild Weather with Kevin Riley tonight. We have uh, some interesting conversations going on here about rainfall versus snow, what will happen with us. I'm going to bring my projections here. The final projections for snowfall in the air. Here's our projections. Mainly rain down here, it's going to be mainly rain here in Delaware. Okay, it's one to two inches, trace, let's say trace to one inch, excuse me, in this general location of Delaware, Maryland, and especially in the warmer waters of the Chesapeake. We have to watch out for that. Moving further north, with a strong fetch off of the ocean, and that's the problem, strong fetch off the ocean, the waters are in the 60s, the five off Atlantic City to be exact. You can see mainly rain here on that line. The one to two inch line, they go back into Philly area. So you're going to only be looking at one to two inches of snow in that general location. One to two inches, sorry, or in this situation, storm in this situation. You get further north and west, okay, we're talking about the upper parts of the county. Uh, this is going to be the area that's going to be kind of a squeeze play. I'm going to say three to six. This is going to be up with pot in that area, three to six inches of snow. Or maybe a little further north of that, but you can see upper parts of Chester, upper parts of Montgomery, north of the Trenton area, in Mercer County, northern Mercer County, and we're talking about closer to six inches. So we go north of that part, the point of maybe is going to be heavier. So I'm going to draw the line here. I'm going to say this eight, twelve inches plus of snow. Going on here, we may have some areas that may be over a foot here. Here, the token areas are going through that. This is the call that I'm making here for the snowfall. The snowfall and the reasoning behind it is a strong up, a strong low, and the closer they close it, the too much warm air will entrench in. Of course, we'll keep the snow melt down here in the Delaware Valley. We're going to move further to the south and talk about the Roanoke Valley real quick, and then we'll include this. Look at the country as a whole, you can see. Look at all the Probabilities in northern wing, they still the area where you can still get eight to ten inches in the interior parts of the uh, northeast. You're looking at a foot of snow, you can see it. So, we got that going on. Weather, weather advisories, or storm watches, all in the eastern half of the United States of America, including the fire danger down here. Northern area, we're going out. Weather advisories, two to four inches, especially about 2,500 feet, and some ice fields. Area. And you see that mountain in the south, that's the best probability to do of heavy snow. Off the first piece of water. If you're live on the blog.com, for your latest weather information, you'll see the updated. For live on the blog.com, you can always be seen data from having a night.